Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Suikoden 4. All right, I made my way back to our headquarters. Uh, we got Rita here. What? You want a rematch? I'm not going to lose again, ever. Uh, no, never mind. What? Really? And see you later. Uh, there's Tov there. Um, let's see. Here is Reinhold. I... How should I put this? Well, I've grown restless with the desire to be more active. <clears throat> uh, let me actually double check to see um, if he is any good with any magic. Eh, he's okay with fire, but it's not really worthwhile. Take me outside once in a while, since I can't swing my sword in the room without breaking something. Uh, actually, I think we are going to be taking you outside. I'm thinking of putting out a newspaper like this. Take a quick look at it for me. Ah, teaser. Launch greeting. At last, this newspaper has been launched to answer the public's questions and meet its demands. With our commitment to reporting the facts in a timely manner, we intend to do our best in informing you. If you have any opinions, comments, or good information, please bring them to Pralt without hesitation. Novel starts. Finally, a serious newspaper novel. Madame Depression by Peralt. A novel that will lead, you leave you lead your bored minds into a dazzling world of love and hate will begin in this issue. Please send your fan letters to Peralt. Madame Depression, Chapter 1. This married lady always behaved depressed, so those around her called her Madame Depression. Madame Depression's husband had passed away, which left her to live alone with her son. Madame Depression gathered up her reddish silver hair and murmured, Oh, I am so depressed. Uh, yeah, good, good story. And there are no back issues. Yay. Hmm. I don't know how I feel about that. Ah, uh, another, another terrible, terrible, uh, novel. A serial novel. Uh, I want to change party members. Um, I want to take out Chipu. Okay, so we could put in uh, Reinhold, Mitsuba, or Rita. So Rita is looks decent with magic, actually. Let's uh, okay. Let's see. Let's take a look at her status. Oh, incidentally, we can also do this. Let's see a nice full portrait of everyone. We see what lovely hammer. Ah, she's a hammer wielder. Um, does she have a she has star earrings? Not sure what those do. Um, doesn't say what runes she's using. She does not have a rune. Uh, she's about equal to Kenneth with lightning. Uh, although it looks like she has slightly more magic. Uh, let's see. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, 5, 2, 1, 6, 3, 1, yeah. Uh, let's see, magic 83 and 66. Oh, and you can also see Louise. Um, don't think I'll use her, though, right now. Um, I might switch her out for Kenneth at some point, but not right now. <clears throat> Instead, we are going to take uh, Mitsuba out. Oh, you baddies better watch out! Uh, I hope she has some decent equipment, at least. Uh, attack 118, 171. I'm going to have to boost up her weapon a bit, it looks like. Uh, let's see. Strength 98, 67, 55, 78. So, yeah. Should be pretty nice. Um, iron Mail, Iron Helm, Iron Boots. Yeah, actually, she has... Uh, some decent, uh, um, equipment there. Oops. I want that. Okay. Uh, Paula could take a left-hand rune. Um, so could Kenneth. Uh, Mitsuba only has, uh, space for a right-hand rune. And Mitsuba is... What is she good with? She's... 
Um, best with wind. She's not... She's good with wind, but not great. We'll put it that way. Um, or she's not good with water, and she's okay with everything else. Uh, well, go ahead and alter her equipment a bit. Uh, hands. Give you those bracers. Um, yeah, that's fine. Iron helm. Um, totally put the lottery uh, ticket on her. Yeah, Vade goes up with the shin guards. Ah, it's okay. Oh yeah, uh, what was her... Oops, what was her weapon at? Uh, where can I see that? Uh, seven... One! Ooh, oh, oh, yeah. Ugh, time to go blow some cash. <sighs> well, we'll have to do it eventually, so... Hey, Chipu. Nah. You'll you'll deal with that, son. There is someone else to uh, recruit back in town that uh, um, I did not recruit. That I forgot about. Uh, so let's go do that, and then we will go to the ruins. I think it was that, uh, what was his name? Ornan? Can't get you yet. That will be later. Oh, and I did try going to, uh, Ilya Island, but, uh, just, it just can't yet. Um, it, uh, it will not let me. Um, and what I decided to do is, uh, fr uh, take off the, uh, um, uh, frame limiter. So, essentially, fast-forward type thing to, uh... No, that's not where I want to go. I think he is over here. So, it, that's much better at getting from place to place quickly. Um, let's, well, let's actually go get him first. Ornan, over here, where are you? There you are. Hmm, I see. You're gathering capable men. Then won't you allow me to join you as well? The truth is, I'm looking for a certain woman, but to no avail. Won't you join me on my search? Um, alright. Then it's decided. I shall be counting on you. Ornan has joined us. Then I shall also head for this place where you are... where you all are gathering. Thank you. Alright. So, yeah, I want, uh, Mitsuba instead of Chipu because Mitsuba should do a lot more damage. I'm hoping. Uh, strength and well. Whoops. Stone Breaker. Of course, I'd have to go to another town to get it all the way up to seven, but eh, whatever. We'll deal with that later. <clears throat> Alright. Uh, let's see. I don't know if I actually want to attach any rune pieces or not. I don't remember what it does, what it really does in this, uh, game, other than change the damage type of your weapon. That was odd. And, to be honest, I'm not sure if it matters that much. You know what? Uh, let's, uh, equip a rune, lightning orb on Paula. So she at least has uh, the ability to do a little bit more damage. I'm really not going to be using Wind of Sleep. Wind of Sleep is just... It's just really not a good spell in this ga in these games. Alrighty, let's uh, head over here to the... Uh... Huh, now there's someone here. Interesting. Hey, uh, white-haired boy. Have you received permission to enter? Uh, yes, I have. <clears throat> ah, permit. We finally have visitors to show around. Thank you for waiting. I am your guide, Rakiji. Huh. Yeah, that name sounds familiar. Allow me to show you around inside. Rakiji has joined your company.
I don't remember this part of the game. Oh, well, I don't remember the... Uh, getting through the ruins that much. I do remember this part in Suikoden Tactics. Oh, and if I haven't mentioned it, uh, right now we are essentially at the earliest chronological Suikoden game, uh, with the exception of a brief portion of Suikoden Tactics. I do not remember where everything is around here. Um... Uh, let's see. There is a lot of treasure in here, so I want to get it. Ah, Thunder Amulet. Excellent. Um, so, yeah. Um, we are at the earliest chronological point in uh, the Suikoden series. We are, I think it's 150 years before Suikoden 1. Um, which is one of the reasons why you could not import... Uh, characters from previous games into this one. Jellyman, huh? You know what? Screw it. I'm just gonna auto. Whatever. Oh, yeah. Ald can take him out in one hit. That's that's good. Nice damage. That wasn't even a critical. So that's why I wanted to bring her along. That damage. Mm. So good. And she should gain some levels pretty quickly. Ah, 5,000 potch. Nice. Um. Hmm. Actually, hold on a second. Uh, let me look something up, because uh, it almost looks like I should be able to get someone else before going in here that I didn't think I could get yet. Uh, do, do, do. Where is this? Um. Oh. You know what? Yeah, let's, uh, actually, let's go recruit them first, because the person that I'm thinking of is missable. Um, so we, ooh. oh, that just, that is not lightning like it was in previous games, and don't miss Mitsuba, I'm relying on you to, uh, kill things for me. Alright, let's go after the unicorn, I think the unicorn is more dangerous. Yeah, that's fine, go after me. I'm pretty sure that damage does less to me than it does to other people. Did that thing just resurrect? Oh, I hate that. Alright, so anyway, what I was saying was, uh, um... Oh, they must resurrect at the end of a round if they're not all dead. I think that's what it is. Oh, I forgot about that mechanic. Um... So yeah, I want to make sure that I recruit this person that I'm thinking of because uh, they are missable very easily. You have a, a fairly narrow window to get them. Um, and what I was also saying is that I remember this place uh, to a certain extent more from Suikoden Tactics than this game. Partly because... You don't have, you know, quick battles like this in, in Suikoden Tactics. It is a game uh, in the vein of Final Fantasy Tactics, Tactics Ogre, that sort of thing. Um, so there are no quick battles in that game. There really are no quick battles. Uh, and I think that this area is kind of a... I mean, most of those games have like a multi-level dungeon area where you can go and uh, get lots of treasures and stuff like that. I think that area... Ooh. Yeah, there goes, uh... I don't like these guys. Here's Kenneth. Thank you, Mitsuo. Got a lightning room piece, though. Um... Oh, I really need to buy some items, too. That's... That's right. Uh... Gain hit points, defense up for three turns. Oh, okay. Mega Medicine. Um, yes. Go ahead and heal you up. Is something the matter? Uh, I need to go outside. Rocket G has left your company. 
Okay. Yeah, I need to... I definitely need to go buy some items. I do not enough, have enough uh, healing stuff, and... And really, in these games, the, uh, the rune... The rune healing abilities are... It should really be used for combat, whereas the items should be used out of combat. There's so many different healing items that you can get. Uh, let's see. Here we go first. Uh, you don't have anything with bargain items. Um, let's get that many. Let's get that many. Um, let's get that many. That many. Uh, I don't really care about those. I don't really care about that. I did pick up a. Uh, um, a thunder amulet, so let's go ahead and equip that. Alright. Alright, then we want to stay at the inn. Yes, I'd like to rest. Stay the night. I will save it. I actually have not saved it in quite a while on uh, the memory card. <laughs> yeah, it's been a little while. Uh, and then there should be someone nearby. Um, hmm. Let's see. Alright, maybe uh, I do do this after the, uh, the ruins. Wait, maybe it's here. Nope. Hmm. Yeah, it's not them. All right, well, uh, let's go do the uh, ruins then. In that case, um, I need some healing items anyway, so that's that's really the important thing. I don't think completing the ruins uh, triggers uh, the next events quite yet. I think there's uh, some other stuff in between. Hi, Rocky G. Uh, yes, we'll count on you to be our guide. Thank you. Not that you're actually guiding us much here. <clears throat> like, you're certainly not guiding us away from enemies. Alright, let's start with the unicorns. Ow. Nice! Um, go after... No, don't go after that guy, because he's going to get back... That's fine. Yeah, I definitely take less damage than that. Although, again, I'm not... Ooh. Nice. Although I'm not sure if that's simply because of my armor or if that's because of my rune and my rune affinity. I'm not sure if rune affinity does much in this game with regards to damage. It should. I don't know. Okay. Um, we did that down there, so let's go up this way and over here. Nope. Apparently not. No item. Darn you. So yeah, it looks like Louise heals up like 25 hit points or something like that. It's said that these ruins were made by were made in a way that would scare people from entering. So once inside, it's easy to lose your way. They say that dangerous creatures also lurk about the ruins. You are actually the first visitors to come here. Are you related to Jewel? I mean, you're whitish, blondish hair, and you've got a triangle on your forehead. That would mean this is your first time being a guide. <laughs> That's right! Oh, great. 
Seriously, Rocket G, guide me away from the monsters. Ah, these guys again. Go after the unicorn. Take out the unicorn, and then the rest of these guys aren't that bad. And of course, he goes with that thing. Oh, don't miss the unicorn. There we go. Wow. Of course, he's going to get back up. All right. Let's go ahead and auto. That works. Another level for Mitsubo. That's good. Ooh, uh, oh, uh... Let's go this way. Hopefully this is leading to treasure. I want to treasure. Yes, it is. Good. My treasure instincts lead me right. Magic hand. What the hell is a magic hand? Curse you, pot of failures. I guess that is going to be an equipable item. Um, magic Hand. Part of Magic Set. Uh, she can equip it. Magic goes up. Magic Defense goes up. Evade goes down. Instead of the Kite Shield. Hmm. Sure. Let's do that. All right, let's continue on. This doesn't seem like that much of a place that would get you lost, since it's mostly dead ends. Of course, when you have to fight these things, then... I can see how that would be dead ends. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. Thank you for killing that one, Mitsubo. Don't go after those guys. I said stop it. Alright, well, I will have to plan out our attacks a little bit better in that case. Just check to see how many hit points we have. And that one's gonna get up. Yeah, okay. It's still okay on hit points. Kill them! Kill them all! Thank you. Oh, got a antitoxin unicorn horn. I was not expecting to get items from that. I really should equip a lottery ticket just to see what I get. See, again, these ruins really are not, you know, getting you lost. They're, they're quite straightforward, actually. Okay, this time... You are on unicorn A... A and B. Alright, let's go. Don't miss anyone. Crap. <laughs> She's asleep now. <sighs> there we go. Damn it. And now she's poisoned. Fantastic. Well, at least we killed them. Alright, I don't like those guys very much. Rockaji, you need to be a better guide. Guide me around these things. Uh, let's see. Um... There are quite a few more items to get in here, so... Got a... Ways to go. Uh, three of these guys? Okay. Should be able to take them out. Maybe. Uh, does seem to have fewer hit points when they come back, at least. Mitsuba, wake up. Thank you. There we go. I'm getting annoyed at the damage you guys are taking here. Let's go this way. Ah. 
Alright, seriously, Mitzbus, you need to stop going to sleep. Alright, let's see how this goes. Hopefully they don't kill him. Good. Alright. And no one is asleep! Congratulations, people! Alright. Let's see. Any good items in here? Ah, yes. There is a treasure chest there. Ooh! Hello! Um... The hell? Angel hairball. Well... Uh, uh, this seems to be a thing. Let's just auto it. What's it gonna do? Ow! 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 Kill it, please! Alright, you guys are not doing much damage. Okay, you know what? Screw that. Rune of Punishment. Angel Hairball. Uh, Rune. Let's go with Healing Wind on Ald. Soaring Bolt. And Item Mega Medicine on Paula. And it goes first. Ow, ow, ow. Party was defeated. Okay, well, um, give me an option to uh, retry that, please. Continue. Yeah. Try it again. Yeah. Time to murder its face with uh, runes. All right. Uh, definitely should have healed up before this. Uh, well, Paula should have. Uh, we'll do something about that. All right. Rune of punishment. Eternal ordeal. Uh, rune, Lightning Rune, Soaring Bolt, Angel Hairball, Rune, Lightning Rune, Soaring Bolt on the Angel Hairball, and Item, uh, Medicine on Paul. And it's gonna go first, it's gonna use that Ice Attack. Probably should have done Mega Medicine, but no, we'll see. Still, this amount of damage hopefully will destroy it. That is not 600 damage. That is not 600 damage. on Ald. This is gonna... Oh, he's doing something different. Ah! Holy... Holy crap! Thank you. How many hit points does this thing have? I should have looked at this first, because uh, yeah, it said uh, the it does say that this is pretty much going to be too difficult for us to uh, take right now. Um, retreat. I can retreat. Good. Okay. Well. Um. Yeah. Yeah, about that. Well, that sure blew a whole bunch of my, uh... My runes? Alright, well, um... Let's not do that yet. I thought there was going to be a, uh...
Yeah, apparently the golden hammer is in there. Hmm. Okay, well, I guess we won't be going there for quite a while. We're probably going to need copious level 4 magic before we can do that. And that guy's going to come up because I didn't kill the other guy. Yep. No, it's just off. Ah, oh, well, that was kind of a disappointment. Well, let's go this way. Actually, it's about time to end the... Ooh, hello. Ah, oh, one-piece dress. Um... Uh, magic defense goes up, but that's about it. I'll hold off on that. All right, well, we got uh, two options to go, uh, so we'll choose that in the next episode. See you then!